Hello everybody, Andrew Maeski here with Dental L. So how are you going to help your patients keep their teeth as healthy as possible so they don't turn into this, where they get a cavity, you can see it in, in between, you can see it on top, not so nice, right? So what I'm telling my patients is, yes, the obvious, brush every day, twice a day. Um, if you don't like to get in between the teeth every day, which you should, then use a water pick. If they don't have one, they can purchase one pretty much anywhere, like Walmart, Shoppers, but I like to go to Amazon because they can pick kind of the water pick that they want. It doesn't have to be by any certain company, but that helps them clean in between the teeth. And I am also telling them to use a mouthwash. Use a special anti-cavity mouthwash just to help to keep the mouth as clean as possible and keep those, those you know, cavity-causing acids out. Because anytime you, you eat anything, if it's sugary, you will get that sort of extra acid attacks in the mouth and that's what causes a cavity. So keep extra care, drink lots of water. Um, and until they're able to see their dental hygienist, um, that will just kind of help to hopefully keep things as healthy as possible. Now, what if you have a patient that says to you, I think I might have a cavity. So they might be looking on top and seeing, okay, well I have this black spot there or a brown spot, or they might even see like a little spot in between the teeth sometimes. So if that happens, let them know that a cavity doesn't get any smaller. They need to have it looked at as quick as possible and still, you know, brush the area as best as possible, use a mouthwash, all of that, but a cavity just doesn't go away. So they need to have it looked at to get fixed as soon as possible. Um, if they're able to go somewhere and they use like a little liquid called silver, um, silver diamine fluoride, they can actually put the liquid on and that will help to stop that cavity from getting bigger. It doesn't change how anything looks, so they would still see that black spot, but that, that bacteria that's causing this to get worse and worse won't get worse, so it helps the cavity not get any bigger. But it doesn't work for everything. Like If you have such a big cavity that it's like this, even into the nerve here, it's kind of too far gone and they will need to go to the dentist to get a filling. So the key is to catch everything early enough, stay healthy, but to catch everything early enough so that even if they have a little cavity, you can hopefully stop it before it gets worse. So I hope that helped you guys. Let me know if you have any questions.